Hello folks, this is G-Wave here, and we are at the final level of Infamous Second Son. Now this is the level, and this could take some time, but either way, we are going to be doing this. So we are going to be doing the good ending. Expose Augustine, the evil ending is when you kill Augustine, and everyone thinks she's a hero, so we're going to expose her, obviously. Okay, I can work with that. Even if the rest of it is still active. Yeah, it's a shame that you don't got coal's powers, Delson, electricity. Attack my angels. You guys are everywhere. Okay, unfortunately we need to get rid of our video powers in order to do this part. Oh man, he messed up my jump. Smart move. There we are. Oh shoot, I'm going in a big circle. There we are. Oh shoot, messed up. Okay, that was my fault. Okay, you wanna go up this way. That's a setback. Hey D, saw a trail of bodies over in Pioneer. Proud of you and followed him. Hope you don't mind. Yup, Fetch survived. Thank you, Fetch. Seriously, I really like the music in this game. Happy to see me? I had of course. Oh, I know, but the hell you did. So this means you're along for the ride? You kidding? My two favorite people in the world in a knockdown drag out? Wouldn't miss it for the world. Hey, Dom. More smoke toys. Thank you. So yeah, Fetch is alive, and she's going to help us in the final showdown. Well, not in the final showdown, she's going to help us get the Augustine. Thank you, Fetch.
Delson, you climbed higher. But good energy saying that I think I can. I think I can. That was good. These guys are chumps. Give me something bigger. Okay, okay, that's bigger. Thank you, Fetch. So it is much easier with Fetch helping us. There we go. Keep on going. You're down. Looking for that? That's your lifesaver. Yeah, and watch this, guys. Hey, Fetch. This would be a good time for some backup. Ask and ye shall receive. Eugene is alive. Eugene? Man. Sure know how to level the playing field. It's good to have friends in high places. Yes, it is. So yeah, the difference in the final showdown is that Fetch's lasers are not pink. In evil mode, her lasers are red. And Eugene, instead of angels, he summons demons, but for some reason he still turns into a giant angel. You know, you would think since his evil mode, he would turn to a giant demon, like in his memories. Come to the vengeance of my angels! Easy on the trash talk, Eugene! Come here. You gotta come see this. Really dumb place for you to stay, my man. Oh, smartest move I've seen all day. Very smart. Looks like it's time to pull out the new tricks. Whole roof's armor plated. Let me try the high beams on it. Uh, you sure you can cut through? Yeah, if you and Teen Angel there can keep the dupes off my ass. Fear not, I shall protect you. How's it coming, Fetch? Don't rush me, Dean. Don't like being rushed. Thank you, guys. Okay, Augustine. Time to get your butt kicked. Oh, good. You're here. I've been watching you, Delson Rowe. Testing you while you assembled your little bag of tricks. Very impressive. You see, Augustine's putting on her fake face. I know all about what you did, too. Using Hank to set up that crash. Making Eugene and Fetch look like monsters just so you could look like the hero? Someone has to protect the conduits. Protect? In the seven years since my DUP took over conduit oversight from the military, not a single one of our kind 
has been killed. Bull crap! Of course not. You just hunt them down and lock them up. Yes, in Curtin K. Protected from the mobs that want to kill conduits. It's what's best for them, whether they know it or not. See, she's put on a fake face. Just make that decision for her, huh? This is all fake. Decisions are too important. This is all fake. This is not the real Augustine. People look at you on the street. Do you know how rare it is for the powerless to embrace a conduit? See, Augustine only cared about power. To use that popularity, that trust, to convince them that the only solution to the bio terrorist menace is my DUP. Did you know that over half the conduits who died in the bloodbath seven years ago were killed by the military? If they regain control, what makes you think things won't return to those good old days? This is all fake. Augustine is just saying this to look like a good person. Oh. Delson can see her fakeness. I expose you and your deception. Then we'll see who the real protector is. This is just fake. This is the fake Augustine. Be a death sentence for all conduits. I can't let you do that. And I won't let you stop me. You mean a death sentence for you, you twat? Where is she? Where is she? Where is she? There she is. Man, Augustine really isn't crap. Watch, the moment I do this, Augustine's gonna show her real face right now. Watch, see? Augustine's about to show her true colors. You got it. Seven years ago, my unit was there to save lives from a new threat. Conduits. People with powers that no one understood. They had the power to kill. And the power to transform some of us into conduits, too. I found another survivor. She tailed me as I made my way back to the safety of my battalion. Together, we traveled through a lawless city that wanted us dead because of what we now were. Every day, people joined the lynch mob, horrified by the thought of conduits hiding among them. We'd hurt no one, but they could only see us as monsters. When military order finally asserted itself, they treated us as the threat. Watch what Augustine did. I was a conduit. I was military, but I couldn't be both. So I made another option. It was the only way. She betrayed that little girl. Bringing first conduit alive, I'd earned the government's trust. And that was just the start. They funded the creation of the DUP, thinking we were just freaks, hunting down other freaks. But that wasn't it. I was going to save as many conduits as I could. If my kind were going to live, it'd be behind the walls of Curtin K. See, like, she's basically saying locking up people for no reason is good. Like, this is a fake. Augustine 
has a huge victim in Talus. Me. I won't let anyone. No, you didn't. Not the government. Not the army. Not you. You're full of crap, you know that? Just keep them locked up. You just took away their freedom. So tell me, what would you do? Just throw open the gates at Curtin K Station? Set them all free? You bet your ass I would. The world hasn't changed in the past seven years. Inside, the conduits are safe. They're alive. If you turn them out, they'd all be dead inside a week. So tell me, who's the savior? And who's the monster? You. This is what you wanted. You win. We both have the same power. Only difference is, I've had seven years to practice. See, look at this. Augustine looks like that one rock Pokemon from Black and White, but I don't know the name. I forgot it. You know, Eugene, you can, uh, you know, shoot from the window. Also, notice how Augustine is fighting Delson when he can't fight back. Like I said, she's a massive coward. Okay, so this is the first power, just uh, a dash ability, that's it. Whoa, I just... I just ran out the game for a second. Oh shoot. Oh shoot, ran the wrong way, shouldn't have done that. Yeah, this whole fight in the beginning is just you gotta wait for Eugene. Seriously, she looks like that one Pokemon from Black and White. Yeah, I watch Pokemon. I can't catch that. Come on. Yeah, this is, uh, this is the only way I can fight her. Oh look, she's Onyx now. And you gotta wait for your concrete abilities to recharge by themselves. Hover.
Look, she's an onyx again. I know, right? We don't even get an ultimate attack. This is the one thing I hate about this fight. We don't get an ultimate attack. We just get normal attacks. Like, wouldn't it make sense to end the fight with an ultimate? Like, Delson summon mass spikes everywhere, like map boulders, rock pillars, and all that. So yeah, just keep on moving around when Augustine comes for you. She's Onyx again. Like again, yeah, I'm a bit bummed out that, you know, they couldn't end the fight with an ultimate for Delson, like, yeah, you don't get an ultimate in this fight. You don't. And that's why this fight isn't all that good. Like, yeah, it looked cool at first, but you can tell that this fight was a bit rushed. Let me get out of here. And she's down. Yeah, I'm told that hurts. Yeah, he uses her line. When the dust finally settled, all you could see of Augustine were her eyes peering out from that concrete shell. The rage that had filled them moments earlier was now replaced by fear. Yup, this is Augustine's true color. She is a massive the coward. The fortress she had built, the army she had raised, the future she had planned. The entire world was about to know that she had failed. Yup, and that she's a coward. Taken down by a gamer, a junkie, yeah. a small town delinquent. The crowds cheered as Augustine was hauled away. Before all this, no one would have imagined that humans and conduits could coexist. And now I was the guy kicking off the second age. 
Oh, and those conduits who'd spent years locked inside the walls of Curtain K? They were soon to be free once again. To yep. live their own lives, to choose their own futures. As for me, I would gotten what I came for. And now, now I had a promise to keep. Time to keep Delmas, Delmas, Delson's promise. Hi, Betty. You're here. And look, I cured you. It's gone. Yeah. <laughs> They're all gone. A promise is a promise, right? Yep. And the others? I just got here on my first stop. Yep. Hey, we're comish. We take care of our own, right? Yeah, the bad ending's more sad. Where's Reggie? And I told y'all I'm not doing that ending. Yeah, That's about you. Reggie, he's uh he's not coming back. Again. Reggie saved me. I know there are theories that Reggie's alive, but Technically, this is the last Infamous game. After this, the franchise ends. We didn't get a new Infamous game after this. I love you, brother. Yeah. I'm sure gonna miss you. Look at that. Delson's putting down the spray paint. Now this is just beautiful. Now this really shows you that even though Reggie and Delson had their differences, Delson always loved Reggie. So yeah, guys, we did it. We finished Infamous Second Son. Boy, oh boy, this was a good game. This was a fun game, like, I give this game a, a a seven out of ten. Yeah, a seven is still a good a good level. Like a seven, no wait, eight. I give it as an eight, a seven, or an eight. The reason why I give it a seven or an eight that it is a good game. I love the fighting. I love everything, and I love Delson's powers and all that. And the story is good. The problem is that the game was rushed. That's why I, I can't give it a, a 10 because the game was rushed in development because, you know, this game, they wanted to get this game out in the release date of the PS4. <clears throat> Sorry, they want to get this game out the release date of the PS4. That's why it got rushed in development. So that's why I give it like a 7 or an 8. And there were some plot holes missing. Like I think Fetch and Eugene were supposed to have more scenes in the game. Like, there was supposed to be more, and, like, Delson was supposed to get, like, a whole bunch of other powers, too. Like, a bunch of powers Delson was supposed to get. Like, I heard they had to scrap some characters because of time development. And not just that, but the final boss with Augustine, it's an okay fight. Like, I can't say it's a really good boss fight final boss level because all Augustine really does is that she walks around. Yes, I died once, but that was because I made a mistake. But all she does is just walk around. She turns into wannabe Pokemons like an Onyx and that one Pokemon from Pokemon Mon Black and White, the name I forgot. But this was still a good game. And I also am disappointed that you could tell this game was rushed because they didn't give Delson a final attack in his rocks, in his concrete powers. Yeah, that's right. You can't, Delson does not get a final attack with his concrete abilities. He does not. So you can only do just shooting and blasting people. And that's just it. But yeah, we finish and yeah, we, we did the good mode. Now I'm not playing the evil mode. I don't like playing the evil mode because it makes me feel like, you know, a little sad and all that so yeah so this was a okay game like it's good i like it infamous is one of my favorite playstation exclusive franchises 
but it was a good game nevertheless. And I just want to show y'all real quick that like, what I can do in rock form. Like with my concrete powers. Like see, I can run. Oh shoot. And I can hit. And look, I can drain the concrete from the DUP soldiers. Like, see, if you want to recharge with your concrete, just drain from the DUP. So, yeah, that's really all you can do with concrete. And what I mean is that you don't get any powers, special other abilities. Like, yeah, you can do this. Like extended dash and all that. But look, no super attack. Like, that's what I don't like. There is no super attack for concrete. And that's what really pisses me off is that you don't get no super attack from concrete. What the heck, sucker punch? And that's how you can tell that this game, yeah, despite it turning out good, it was rushed in development. Like it was really rushed. And that's the only bad thing about this game. So I'm gonna end this here, and this was a okay, it was a nice game, like it wasn't a bad game. But again, had, they just given Sucker Punch more time, like had Sucker Punch and Sony not been in a rush to release the game at the release date of the PS4, this game would have turned out a lot better. Like it would have turned out much better than what we got. So I'm gonna end this here and I hope you guys enjoyed this game. This was nice, and I really want the Infamous franchise to be finished, because I think it's over. Like, I think they canceled the franchise because this game didn't sold as much, and that's why they made a DLC, First Light, where you play as Fetch. Yeah, that's right. There's a DLC where you play as Fetch. And we are going to play it one of these days. Like, I'm going to think of which game I'm going to play next, but I hope you guys enjoyed this playthrough, and this was a nice gameplay. This was really nice. So I hope y'all enjoyed this. Like, subscribe to the channel, check out my TikTok and Instagram. I really consider playing this game, but again, you're gonna see that it could have been better had it not been rushed. Had it not been rushed, we would have gotten a lot better than what we got. Cause Delson was supposed to encounter more people. He was supposed to, he was supposed to basically, you know, get different powers and abilities and he was also supposed to meet different meet cole i think like i think delson was supposed to meet the cole friends like i think he does like i think there's a dlc content that you go and work with cole's friends hinting that cole is possibly dead so i really hope they bring back infamous and if they do we continue as delson and let's hope the next game isn't rushed because it is theorized that, you know, Sucker Punch is finished with Infamous. Like, it's chrono think that, you know, chronologically, this is the final Infamous game. This is like the end of the Infamous franchise. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. Like, subscribe to the channel, and check out my TikTok and Instagram if you want to see some other fun stuff. And I'll see you guys next time. We'll do yet another Infamous. I mean, I'm talking like I'm going to play this game again. Nah, I'm not going to play this game again. Like, when we do another gameplay of another game. This is G-Wave signing out. Peace, God bless, and have a good day or night depending what time you're watching this. I give this game a 7 or an 8 because it had some problems because it was rushed in development. But it's still a good game. I hope you guys like this. Ciao!